What's cool? What's groovy? What's happening? And welcome back to my channel. It's time for life. Okay, so we're going to start out with a braid out. So this would have been braids that you put in maybe a few days ago or a few hours ago and you let dry, depending on how long your hair takes to dry. But you could also do it um, and take it out on your next wash day. So now we're going to actually comb the hair. We're trying to detangle the hair, make it as smooth and as straight as possible. So I just grab the middle of the hair piece that I've got there and start from the bottom of that hair piece and start working my way up. So making sure that the bottom is detangled before I even go up the way and keep going until the comb can basically just glide through the hair. And comb that really well from all sides then I use a Demerin brush because that's really good at detangling and I add some oil now what this oil is going to do is make it really really smooth and silky and manageable and yeah and I use my fingers to kind of detangle usually I don't even use combs anymore these days I use my fingers anyway but for this process I use combs because I want it to be so stretched and so smooth so you can see at the tips there you can see how brittle and how dry they are just from the fact that they are so uneven and kind of see-through as well and that is the part you want to cut off the part that's kind of see-through and not consistent at all that's what you want to cut off so you get this nice dense thick hair at the tips at the ends so that's the before and boom bam that is the after yeah, that's what we want that's what we want then we twist it we get it out of the way and basically I'm just working with the sections that I had when I made the braids in the first place so those are the sections that I'm working with now to actually trim my hair so I'm not doing anything extra I just remove the braids and then kind of comb them out detangle them cut it and twist them to get them out of the way is such a satisfying thing to do just trimming and I used to go to the hairdressers in fact I used to go to a barber and I would just keep my hair in my natural afro state so it would just be like a big afro big old afro on my head and then I'd let the barber cut it and he would comb my hair and it would be so 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 painful so I'm really happy that I'm able to do this now just with like a braid out and do it at home and it's great look at all that breakage so yeah that's what we don't want but this this right here this, this right here this is what we want so keep on doing that throughout the whole hair twist it get it out the way and then I just check the length and just to show you that it is the same length Hope you enjoyed this video make time for life it's time to start living it right peace see you in the next time bye that's all my hair you can make a wig out of that anyway so now i went to style my hair i washed it basically and i came to style it and i used r&b hair moisturizer by lush and that stuff is so thick and smells so good so so good and I actually do use more products, which I will display in a future video, but I just thought I'll show this moisturizer as nobody really mentions it that often and it's really bomb. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Look at them popping curls. They look so good. I was really happy with the result. And my hair has stayed healthy ever since. See you in my next video. Comment, like, and subscribe. Music as always was brought to you by Young Kingler. Remember to make time for glorious life.